Hello, this is my tutorial on how to play Shadow Warrior multiplayer. Yeah, that's right. Well, you won't need the Steam version Classic Redux. I'm sorry to say that, but you won't. Instead of it, you, uh, we're going to use the Shadow Warrior Classic Complete from Good Old Games. Uh, so, I've already downloaded that. Yeah, it's here. And I also install it on my desktop. So here it is. And now if the folder is ready with the game inside, we can download uh, the port called Shadow Warrior port. It's right it's right there. A link in the description. And I've also already downloaded that. Yeah. It should be there. Yeah, great. So let's open it and everything from this uh, zip file just copy into our Shadow Warrior complete folder. Yeah, that's great. Now when is it ready? Uh, we can test that. Uh, through yeah, through this through this file called SVP. Great. I'll just change the resolution white screen and I can increase the sample rate and now it should work yeah it works great but uh, there can be a small problem with the sound probably you started and you can hear uh, the low wings voice but uh, it's, it's crappy so uh, go to properties compatibility and start a program with compatibility for Windows Vista and uh, try to run it as an administrator so if you done that you can run it again and you'll hear that the low wings voice is okay now it's great the game should work yeah it, w it works just great yeah okay now uh, we're going to download uh, the second uh, expansion which is included in our in our folder but uh, there isn't the main file uh, which is called uh, twin dragon dot grp yeah and it is in the second uh, second link which is in the description we're going to download Twin Dragon yeah I've also already already downloaded it so I'm going to use this one and this is our Shadow Warrior folder and just copy the Twin Dragon GRP into the folder now we've got uh, the add-on you can also play it in single player if you want through the SVP uh, just make a shortcut of the SVP and add an argument which will be G twin drag dot GRP yeah, that should work or wanton destruction this this is the wanton destruction expansion and where's the second one and this is the twin dragon expansions these are GRP files with textures and some important stuff for the expansion. And now when I run this new shortcut, you don't have to do it you don't have to do this for the multiplayer of course. And now I can start single player uh, single player twin dragon campaign. Yeah, it works it works just well. So, uh, that's it. N now, we can start with the multiplayer setting. We're going to need Yank, which is uh, Yank yet another netplay guide, uh, which will do everything with our multiplayer. We're going to download the Win32 installer. Yeah, I've already downloaded that. Uh, This is it. Install it on your computer and 
it should appear somewhere. Yeah, it's here. Now some windows should appear like if you satisfied with the with the terms of use. So just click yes, 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 of course, and uh, this this window should appear. So click on Shadow Warrior and select the Shadow Warrior port, which is in our Shadow Warrior folder. I don't know where you install it. And you have to select this 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 port. And that's all. You can click OK. And now everything should work. The multiplayer is ready. And if you want to play the expansions in multiplayer, we're going to go to settings, TC and modes, Shadow Warrior, and we're going to add a new profile. So for wanton destruction, on. Uh, we're going to add the wt dot grp. Yeah, it's here. And for the twin dragon, we're going to add the twin track grp. Okay, that's it. I'll just check it. Yeah, it's here. And now if I start a room, create a room, I'll yeah, I'll can select the mode. For example, if I want to play Twin Dragon, I'll click on Twin Dragon. I'll select the map. Important when when are you playing the default campaign? Uh it should start with level 1. And then if you're playing Twin Dragon, uh, you're starting on level 5, which is the first level of the campaign of Twin Dragon, but uh, something is wrong with uh, these, uh, with this level system. So if we want to play from the beginning, let's just click on level 5. Cooperative, skill of monsters, yeah, room name, and extra arguments for hosts, and that's what I was showing to you. So if you want to play uh, Twin Dragon or Wanton Destruction, you're going to uh, add an argument for Twin Dragon. It is Twin shit Twin Drag that GRP, and for uh, Wanton it would be uh, WT uh, GWT that GRP, yeah. If you are playing the default campaign, uh, leave it leave it blank. If I do OK, our room will appear. And now uh, the computers on your local network should should join. So let's try it. I'm going on another computer. Oh, it fell asleep. I'm going to check my IP address. If you're playing through Hamachi or Evolve, it will be written on uh, the Evolve on or on the Hamachi. But I'm playing on lo a local network, so IP config. Uh, yeah, that's what I'm looking for. Now on the second computer, on the second computer, the the task is really easy. You just uh, start the yank. You also have the the second computer. I did all, everything the same like I did on this computer. And join a room. You add the name of server. It doesn't matter. It's just for you. So testing server in our IP which will be yeah and I can see that server yeah but I can't uh, join to this server in, from the same computer so I will use the second one and we're 
here. It will give you a question if you're playing the if you're playing the expansion. It will uh, give you a question about uh, which GRP you want to choose. So choose the GRP which you are uh, which you are playing, or which is on the host server. You you, you will know that. A new player has joined, and if I launch the game, yes, and yes, yeah, that's some basic settings. Gray, I'm going to be yellow, for example, monsters on hard. Okay, let's try it. So, that's the Twin Dragon campaign from the start, and you can see that there's a second player. Oh, hello, I'm a second player. Look at me, everything works. Yeah, that's great. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. So, that's the main thing, and now the multiplayer works pretty well. Uh, I'll just show you the default set think of the first level okay i'll create a new a new room a new lobby and i'll try to join again action join room Now I've set the default campaign and everything should work. You can see that the second player is here. So that's everything we need. I'll end it on the second computer. And now, if you want, uh, if you want, you can also add a uh, height resolution pack, which will make the game looks better, really better, much, much better. And okay, let's take a look. Yes, yes, it works fine in multiplayer, and you can download the height resolution pack on uh, in on the link in the description I've already downloaded that so we can go to download files yeah here it is it's the height, resolu height resolution pack and we're just going to copy the zip inside the shadow warrior folder And now when when I run the game, doesn't matter if you're running it from the yank or from this uh, executable file, you can uh, apply the high resolution textures and models. And now if you run the game, you'll see that uh, everything looks much better but not the enemies yeah uh, so I really don't like the NPCs so I'm going to uh, destroy their uh, new texture so go to the folder height res and sprites and just delete the folder monsters or change the name of it and now when you start it again you'll see where is it yeah here is it uh, errors you'll see that it looks just much better and these are the default enemies default textures 
but uh, a lot of things are pretty new. You can see that this is 3D now. This helmet is also th in 3D. It looks it looks good. I think it's it's pretty pretty nice. Uh, now uh, that's that's all I wanted to tell you about Shadow Warrior. I'll also uh, give a, a link to my to my settings to my setting file because I'm using uh, smaller crosshair and um, video settings anisotropy. Yeah, that's good. That's good. I'm using a smaller, smaller, yeah, smaller hat. That's good. And also, really important is mouse invert. And now, yeah, it it feels fine. Everything is good. Oh, I love this game. I'm a bit uncomfortable with the with the speed of my mouse, but I will repair it. And that's all. Uh, this high resolution pack should work in in uh, both expansions and uh, the texture which are not retextured in the high resolution pack will just uh, be will will be shown as uh, default texture. And uh, that's all. So thank you. I hope I helped you a lot. Sorry for my English. Uh, but I'm not used to talking English. Well, that's all. Thank you. Give me thumbs up. I will be really happy. Bye.